Hello, hello, hello. All right, guys, so uh, I've unlocked the acid lab. Pretty easy, really. All you have to do is wait for a phone call of Ron. Then you go and do the missions. I think there's six missions, maybe seven. I think there's six and one set up. So you do all the missions and then you go to your drafted garage. And it's as simple as that, really. Then you go to this guy. You want to pay 750,000 to get your acid lab in the back of your vehicle. You can customize your acid lab, put armor on it, the uh, mines, all that good stuff. I put an EMP on it because I thought that might be the best one. Not only can you do that, you can also upgrade the bike, the delivery bike. Uh, only downside is uh, you can't restock it from your nightclub, as I've checked. However, you go to Mott and uh, he resupplies for you. I'm not sure if you can ring him and resupply, you could try, rather than having to faff about going looking for your supplies. You can also speed up your production once a day uh, when you go over to the little table that's inside. So yeah, quick and easy set up, done within an hour. Uh, but yeah, it was nice, it was different. And now we'll just find out what the production is. So, first mission is to take out the Lost Crew uh, as they're attacking you. Then from there, you want to jump in your vehicle and you need to go and pick up an RV. Jump in that, drive it back. Then you're going to pick up Dax. Take Dax to the abandoned warehouse. And then from there, you're going to jump into the next mission. Where you have to drive to the terminal to pick up a truck cab. From there, you'll take your trailer and then you'll start driving that back. However, this will blow up. So make sure you get out of the vehicle, whereas I didn't. Otherwise, you'll just explode. So then you get your vehicle again. Go to the Lost Crew clubhouse. You want to get inside the building after taking the enemies out outside. And there is a door straight ahead, just behind the bar. You want to take a picture of this whiteboard. From there, you want to get the duffel bag off the bar after taking the picture. Pick up all the drugs off the table in the back room. Fill your bag. Then from there, you're going to go back to your freak shop and drop it off. And that's that mission done. Next mission is going to be to go to Stab City and then you're going to destroy Lost Property, which is quite a tough one actually. So I'd recommend you do it with a friend if you feel a bit nervous about it because you've got a lot of Lost crew there. Then from there, you're going to go to the next Lost Crew place. You're going to go to Miller's Fishery for the lost meth. So then there's 10 meth that you need to find around the area while shooting, obviously, to the lost crew. Then steal the dodo. Take the dodo back to your uh, your place. Or the storm drain. Drop it off there. And then from there, that's complete. Next mission. Yeah, oh, this, is, this one you're going to like. You drink. What you think is alcohol, but it isn't. It turns out to be acid. And then, of course, it takes you on an acid trip that you have to complete this. Uh, you have to get on your bike and go through a load of tunnels, and it all changes. It's quite interesting. You'll like it. Then you fall from the sky in just your underwear. And that's that one done quite easily as well. Then it starts to get a bit tougher from there onwards. Then you need to go to the hippie camp, destroy the lab equipment. After destroying the lab equipment, you'll need to check the hippie van. DPS uh, of the other vans. And after that, you want to go and destroy the other vans. You can use your own personal vehicle. I didn't know that at first, but now I do. So you can use your own personal vehicle to do that. If it helps. Then you go to the Atreus camp and destroy vans there. There's a bit, a bit of going here, there and everywhere. And you just leave there and you're good. That one's done. Next one is the Humane's Labs. Now this one, you can sneak around. Uh, I tried, but I did get caught right near the end. But I did try and sneak all, all the way around. Get to the keypad. Put your code in. Then it'll do it itself. You don't have to hack it. Then you want to take a picture of this information here on the wall 
and then open all these crates like so and then from there you need to go to the switching train station you gotta race the train to get to there so be quick switch that over and then you need to take butter from near the train station then you want to go to where the train has crashed it gets a bit hectic here you get choppers you get cars you get people so you might need a friend for this mission you want to search all the white points on the train then you take the brigade i use the train track to get back well use the train track get back and that's that done and that is the start of something special next up you want to go to one of these points on the map any point doesn't really matter to you go in you kill the guards of course use a fort forklift truck to pick up your goods put the equipment on the truck that's inside like so and then from there you'll drive the truck back to your freak shop and your jobs are good and you're ready to go and there's your acid cab set up if you like today's content make sure you like and subscribe and i'll see you on the next one